Hello and welcome back to some more Snooker 19 and part 103 of season 4 of our Ronnie O'Sullivan career mode. Today we finish off the semi-final of the World uh, Championship against John Higgins, the Wizard of Wishaw. We're 16 frames to 8 up. We need just one more frame to get through to the final. And uh, yeah, just to warn you, if, if we do win this early... Then uh, I will be replaying the final session of last One. year's World Championship final after this, just to extend what a beautiful uh, the video. Is. So Great I wouldn't skip shot. to the end if You'd I was you, otherwise that. you'll think Six. that you're in the world the world final. Seven. So yeah, just before people start complaining in the comments, if I release a ten minute video, well. it's fairly obvious 14. that I won it, isn't it? So. 15. Yeah, just to let you know about that, because I know people 20. do get very upset <laughs> regarding it. John Higgins. John, I have no idea 20. why, because it doesn't hurt you, does it? But there you go. So, John managed to, to put a couple of balls there, but. It's a good good safety. John Higgins obviously needing to win every single frame now. Cue ball goes in. Well, he lost control of the cue ball there. Careless. Foul. Ronnie O'Sullivan, four. He's playing on from this position. This is really tricky. It's there. What a magnificent pot that is. And the question is, One. can we get into the reds? I don't think we can, not from this position, so I'm just gonna He's slither looking him to drop this in behind the brown behind ball. The brown. He's got the snooker. That's exactly what Ronnie we do. One. John's played a bit of a hit and hold there. That's a poor shot, a really poor shot. Could have, could have went worse. He's going for the left corner pocket. Excellent shot. One. He's aiming to sink this into the right corner. Well, how did we miss the pack there? <laughs> Unbelievable. Eight. He's going for it. Missed pot. Missed the red. But no harm. Ronnie O'Sullivan, eight. It's going over the corner pocket. I think the yellow's going to come to our rescue, though. So this Great is a shot. tough safety for John. He's trying to use the yellow as his blocker. Needs the cue ball to roll. I think it just about has. Well, the question is, is there any plants on? Possibly. Those two reds are fairly close to a plant. Pace is absolutely critical here. Yeah. All I all I wanted to really do was make sure that I wasn't leaving John an easy pot. I think we might have He'll be pleased with that. No, not quite. This is an intriguing safety battle. John hits a knuckle. So, this is a chance to win the match and get our third consecutive World Championship final. This is tough. And win. Well, that's an unforced error. Ronnie O'Sullivan's eighth world title. One. 
and we can get to the green here. So I'm going to go for it. Chance to win the match, you know me. I always go for these. He needs these. to be careful of not overhitting this. Mm, not quite. But have we got away with it? I think we have. He's left a chance. It's not easy, but a chance nonetheless. Ronnie O'Sullivan, one. Yeah. Oh, oh! I thought John had fluked a red there. He hasn't done though. He's made a complete mess of it. That's not the best shot I've seen. Yeah, I can't believe how badly John played that safety. And I no. can't believe how bad his safety play has been throughout the World Championship. Uh, the throughout the match. To me. Don't know how it's been in the World Championship. But to get to the semi-final, you'd imagine he's been playing Eight. somewhere near his best. But... Yeah, you feel like this is very much Nine. the chance to get through to the final. Lost the cue ball a tad there. But we've 16. got on to a colour, on to a red, sorry. Yeah, let's end a break. Can you believe it? This is just pure tension. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 16. Oh, this is a very risky safety shot from John. I think he's left a red to the yellow pocket. Not quite. He's left a red to the left middle, though. That's careless. He's looking at this red. It's there. Down it goes. It's there. Wonderful pot. Outstanding effort. One. Well. This requires good queuing. We know he's blessed with great cue power, and that's a great example of what he can do. He's looking very sharp here. Six. It's a good red. Seven. Fourteen. Fifteen. 25 in front. Red puts us 32 in front, 59 on the table. We need 22. two of these reds with colours. He's taking this on to the right middle. World Championship final. And who will we play? Will it be Mark Selby in a repeat 23. of last year's World Championship final? Or will it be Judd Trump? We've had a few battles with him this season. I'm sure that would be a cracking match. Or will it be somebody completely unexpected, like a Bingham or a Ding or a Hawkins? I'd absolutely adore it if it was one of those. This red. Maybe even Kyron Wilson. That's a top shot. Red goes in. Well, he couldn't have played that any better. So Superb 41 points shot. in front. 31. This black. For a place in the world championship so, final he just needs the black and there it goes there it goes we are in the world championship final for 58. a third consecutive season on the back of winning two world championships in a row yes he's taking the pot on and we've regained our world number one spot this season and although that red isn't there Ronnie Bar and Snookers, we got a chance to win Ronnie O'Sullivan's 8th world title and beat Stephen Hendry's record that he set back in 1999. Unbelievable. Well, I'm going to try and cut this in. 
It's there. I don't think John Higgins will come back to the table. I think that will be it. One. The crowd being their usual loud and self, aren't they? Power. What a match this has been. And although it is going to be 17-8, it's going to be a very comfortable scoreline. Six. It has been a great battle in some frames. This is a half chance. Have gone very close. And Beautiful pop. Had one or two frames gone. Seven. The opposite way, potentially, it could have been a very different match. He'll want this to drop into the centre pocket. But I think what has made the difference in this match Ten. has been the tactical side, and probably for the first time in his career, Ronnie O'Sullivan has out, outthought John Higgins. Tremendous and now played John Higgins in the safety department. Well, John Higgins constantly catching ball colours. He's lining this one up to the middle pocket. Great shot. Fifteen. With the safety shots. 19. I'm going to try and come off a few cushions here to get onto the pink. Lots of power on this shot. Oh, the black didn't really want to hit the black. Now we're not on anything. This is a tricky double on the pink, but we'll, we'll go for it. We knocked in a few doubles in this match, including a cock tack double. You don't often see, but the pink's not there. But it doesn't matter because John Higgins will come forward and wish us luck in the final Sullivan, as we've beaten the four time world champion, the Wizard of Wishaw, John Higgins, by 17 frames to eight. And we make it through to our third consecutive World Championship final. So there you go. A very comfortable looking winner in the end of 17 frames to eight. And you can see, points-wise, we, uh, you know, didn't didn't double John's uh, points total, but you know there was a lot of close frames that we came out on top of. Who are we going to play in the final? Kyron Wilson. <laughs> well, that is that is a fantastic match to look forward to, and a repeat of the 2020 World Championship final in real life. That is unbelievable. I was certain it was going to be Mark Selby. So I am I am really, really happy that it's the Warrior Kyron Wilson. We have had some incredible battles against him over the years, including two years ago in Season 2 uh, in the semi-final where we beat him 17-15. Kyron Wilson, um, you know, was 15-13 up in that match, I believe, and we managed to come out fighting in the end and uh, beat him. 1715. I cannot wait to play Kyron Wilson in the final. And what we're going to do is we're going to have a full Snooker 19 weekend special Friday, uh, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday at 12 p.m. is when the four sessions of the final are going to come out. It's going to be a fantastic match. I cannot wait to show you guys. Can we win Ronnie O'Sullivan's eighth world title and our third world championship in a row? You will have to find out then in the next episode. If you've enjoyed this one, give it a big thumbs up down below. Subscribe for weekly Snooker 19 videos. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye. For the people that want to see a bit more Snooker 19 action today, stick around. I'm going to replay the final session of last year's World Championship against Mark Selby. So uh, you, you can stick around for that and uh, see what happens. So thank you very much for watching. Give it a big thumbs up. I'll see you on Friday for the first session of the World Championship Final. I didn't dream it, apparently. Uh, so Mark Selby. Oh, dearie me, that's a, a terrible break. It really is. Uh, but master difficulty, you know, this, this could make this match very, very interesting indeed. Um, now <laughs> so we'll see how it goes yes, try and drop this ready 
Red Zane. So, we're in straight away here. Remember, we there's eight frames in today's episode. We need just four of them to complete the world title victory. Eight. So, this is a, the perfect start for us to get in and uh, try and win this frame in one visit just over hit that slightly Nine. so first tester and I actually find these uh, shots really difficult on on this difficulty um, mainly because the I'm so used to the the, the fanning the coning uh, but this is just so much more accurate and there you go we miss it straight away the the sort of pot made is so much more accurate on this difficulty than it is on um, Pro Plus difficulty, so I do find it very difficult, but we'll see if Mark Selby can get back into this match now. But disappointing to miss the blue. I can pretty much guarantee I would have potted that on on Pro or Master Plus for that matter. Um, it's. The pot made is just so different Nicely on played. on this Onto difficulty the and pro um, difficulties, and and 13. both of those I've not played since season one, so it's a long time since I've played well, on this pot made. Nineteen. So, well, I thought there might be a red into the right middle, but apparently Mark not. Nineteen. So just a nineteen for Mark Selby. Be reasonably happy with that, I would have thought. Mm, missed that on the way down. It's going to be a foul. That's a foul. You'll be disappointed with that. Just missed the power bar, and that's something that can happen. On this difficulty. Oh. Now then. Not what he intended at all. He'll be annoyed with that. Just wants to sink this into the left corner pocket. Oh, is that going to reach? It is just about. What a top pot that Happy was. with that. One. Right. That'll do. On the red to the right middle. Eight. So, probably spend the first couple of frames just, just getting used to. Into the centre pocket. It's difficult. Eight. Excellent pot. Nine. And then, play the yellow here. Yeah, lots of top spin. He's attempting to sink this into the left corner pocket. Don't think we're going to quite make it. Believe it. Quite. Eleven. Uh, there's the possibility of a plant. It's a bit risky, but it's probably worth the go. Mm, got very close. Wasn't expecting this red to come back up into the bulk area as the white travelled far enough. I'm not sure. 11. It has. So it worked as a shot to nothing. Now the Selby covered it. Mm, it's a bit thin. Oh, I wonder if this red goes. Might well do. There you go. See, it clearly does. Not easy though. Very tricky shot coming up. Brilliant. But it's there, it wobbles in. Wasn't the perfect strike, but we'll settle for it. One. So. Eight. Oh, are we on the red to the far right corner? No, we're not. So it's going to be a horrible little cutback but I actually find cutbacks a lot better on this difficulty than 
on Pro Plus. Because you, as I say, the pot oh, the pot good. made is is so much more accurate. But um, nine. Well, we'll see how it goes. Well, it goes half a chance here. What a wonderful pot! And the cue ball has finished very nicely. Fourteen. Yeah, we were going to start next season on this difficulty anyway, so it made sense to bring it forward a couple of episodes after this match has just seemingly gone so different to what we all expected. Trying to play. Left him a little awkward there. Damn, just hit that so hard. But we're okay because we've got uh, this red into the, the corner. Um, 21. Just need to keep popping them. Yeah. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Happy with that one. 27. Just drop this in, ping into the right middle. Twenty-eight. It's not going too badly so far. Playing for the middle pocket. Thirty-four. Out the pink spot. Drop this in, ping into the left corner pocket. Hopefully, get onto the red on the bottom cushion. Nicely onto the colour. Thirty-five. Can't see anything really going wrong here. Nicely perfect because we wanted an angle on this red. So this red required. Just the red needed. No issues there. And there we go. That should be it. No real way through the so to win the frame now. It's going to be 15-3 now. And well, I mean, if we win all four well, of the opening frames, the we'll equal Steve Davis's record victory in a final 18-3 against John Parrott in 1989 so uh, you know something to, to go for at the very least yeah red doesn't go in but it doesn't matter because Mark Selby will concede and we now lead by 15 Ronnie frames O'Sullivan, to 3 48. frame conceded frame Ronnie O'Sullivan and that is the frame Thank you, frame 19. Ronnie O'Sullivan to break. So, yeah, you have to say it. It's quite unbelievable how this match has gone. Just three frames away now from winning this match. A good safety from. He's not played that well. Tough shot. Uh, uh, bad safety better. from Mark Williams. So uh, Mark Selby, sorry. That's an extra long red. red. Not quite on the the pink. So the trickier positional shot off the. He's taking blue. this on to the right middle. we on one of these reds. I think the the red two up from the top cushion goes. There you go. You can clearly see. So yeah, sorry about the banging. Not a lot I can do about it, I'm afraid. No. Seven. On the pink this time. Top spin trying to get into this pack here. Oh, missed the pack, so yeah, a bit of a misjudgment there. Still got the red into the left corner. But, 13. Oh, have we? No, we haven't because the pink. Oh, the pink has gone on the brown spot, so. 
It's a bit annoying. But never mind. So just for safety. There it goes. He's got the cue ball in a great position. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 13. This cue ball could end up behind the brown. This could be very good for Mark Selby. What a shot. Well, he's got it. Great shot. I think we need to try a two-cushion escape here. He doesn't want to overhit this. Yeah, too hard. Much too hard. So Mark Selby has himself well, a chance it was a really here. really hard shot, and it hasn't worked out for him at all. Foul and a miss. Mark Selby. One. So. Good chance for Mark to get some points on the scoreboard. Seven. Fourteen. Oh, I'm right into the right middle. Fifteen. Got to play some sort of cannon here. He's going for it. Could have went wet a bit there, but uh, he's at least got one red. Beautiful. Quality queuing there, really good. 21. And he's brought another red into play. He keeps bringing one red in, but he's going to need more. Now he's got the perfect angle, so this could be the frame winning shot. He's played it well. Good shot. So that should be the end of this frame now. So we can't equal the biggest victory in a world championship final well, at least you wouldn't think we will be able to you'd think Mark what will win this cost. position looks pretty good to me 37 nicely done played that well 42 Needs to score another 19 points from the 43. The four reds in the open. You feel like that's more than achievable. 50. He's got the red to the left of the black this time. He's finally got onto that one. He's not played it though. He really looks in fine form at the moment. 51. So, blue, red, blue would be enough. You feel? 56. He's okay. I thought it had gone wrong, but he's alright. 57. So, definitely the end of the frame now. Good put on the. Oh. Well, is it the end of the frame? I mean, I cannot believe... Why didn't he play position? What's he doing? I mean, is he trying to lose this match 18-3? I mean, that's that's a potential reason for why he didn't. But uh, he's 55 in front, 59 on the table. That's a top shot. Well played. Wow. One. Can we do it? Quite the break if we could. But we've got a chance, and that's all that really Eight. matters at the moment. Just did not look like we would ever get this opportunity. The right corner. Ah, I've missed the red. Eliminate errors like that. Missed the red. 
Run that was just a bit of carelessness there. Important pot here. No issues there. And that took the more difficult red in this frame. He potted it. One. Down it goes. And so yeah, we'll give him the frame. And he now is only trailing by 11. It's 15-4. But he stopped the rot at least. Mark Selby to break. So we're breaking off now in frame 20 again, going for that attack and break off. It keeps bringing that red up to the left middle pocket, and this time he's left it. He'll be disappointed with that. So. This is being played towards the left middle pocket. Just drop that in. Nicely positioned for the blue here. One. Playing this with a lot of power. And the reds are trying to. <laughs> Not the shot he was aiming for there. He really well, was tight enough on his positional play. That's what happens on this difficulty. You don't have the the white line, and sometimes you can just misjudge them. Now then, there is a bit of a plant here. So I'm gonna sort of aim for the right of the pocket a little bit. He'll be playing safe. Impressive shot. And there the it goes. There it goes. So good recovery shot. Seven. So, try and drop this in. Well, he's taking it on. Got the red to the right, right corner here. What a wonderful pot. Now I'm going to have a little look yeah. at the. The pink, no, pink isn't really an option, so stun over for the blue. Well, now then, a little bit more angle than we'd have liked, but should be all right. This into the left corner pocket. Yeah, super sorry about the, the banging. Seems to have come over to this side of the house now as well, so it's probably even louder. So I do apologise about that. 18. Um, well, let me try and get into the cluster here. It's with plenty of power. Oh, didn't quite go to plan. Not even on. A red. So, end of break. Mm, hit the yellow. Ronnie O'Sullivan, so, 25. Chance for Mark here. Tricky pot, no doubt. Oh, he's missed that by an absolute mile. Unless he's fluked something, which he hasn't. That could be a fatal mistake in this frame. Not easy to knock this red in, though. This is no gimme. Fabulous, but it's there. He'll be happy with that. Top shot. One. Long reds in. Uh, little chance on the on the green here. I'll just overhit that. We're all right though. We've got the red oh. to the right corner. So I'll drop this in. We've got so the black. This pops into the, the right corner. Top cushion. Well, an excellent pop. Simply wonderful. Five. So. Drop the black in. Twelve. So we've got the this red, I think, is the one. We can be on the black again. Nicely. Thirteen.
that could have finished a little better. Okay. Point. Right along the cushion. Just got to be a bit careful with this. He's aiming to sink this into the right corner. Again, knocked it in with a plum. Beautifully done. Not really the level of control he was after there. Lost the cue ball a little. 21. Yeah. Knew we were going to cannon into that red. Just had to make sure we'd be on the red to the left middle. So. Play it with a, a lot of drag. Get onto the blue, the, the the green's fine as well. I'm just thinking about where does the next red come from? So, yeah. Nearly missed that. I've got the red to the same pocket. Now we've got onto the blue nicely. And if we drop in on one of these three reds. Don't care which one we're on. As long as we're on one of them. Here comes the white through the gap. And there you go. Thirty eight. Perfect. Oh. Just this red required to go two frames away. He just needs the red. In it goes. And that shuts the door on his opponent in this frame. 39. Black goes in. 46. Well, it's not been a, a bad frame for us at all. Pretty well. 47. It'd be nice to maybe get a cannon on. The red next to the pink here. No, not quite. I'm quite happy. Fifty four. Okay. Well, he's taking the red on. There goes the red, I think. Yes, just about. So we've got fifty five chance here. A bit of top and left hand side, I think that might get us there. Oh not quite. Just missed it. Might be able to pot it from up here. We'll have a little look. Can't quite get to enough of it, so it'll have to be the double. Not quite. So the red doesn't go in, but it doesn't matter because that break of 62 gives us the frame, and we're now two frames away at 16 4. Frame, Ronnie O'Sullivan. And that is the frame. Well played. So two more frames required for victory. Frame 21, Ronnie O'Sullivan to break. To say well, quite likely, but whatever you do, don't hit the blue, except when it goes well. <laughs> so for that one, Mark's knocked a red over the right corner as he covered it with a green. I'm not sure he has. Well, that's Maybe not worked out quite as he intended it to. Play this with a load of right hand side and try and get into that cluster. I need to sink this into the right corner. Red's in. Get into the cluster. How's our luck? It's okay, I might be able to drop the green in. But could have went better. Could have went a lot worse though. Could have missed the red. Tremendous green. Oh, brilliant. Just look at that for a positional shot. Superb. Or he's going for the left corner pocket. 
That's an excellent point. Decent chance here. Great queuing there. Five. Pace is critical here. Pinks in. It's weird how that well triangle sort of shifted 11. to the right hand side. It's very strange. But, uh, twice across the table. Was meant to be playing the pink, but we'll play the black instead. It's not a bad replacement to have for it, is it? Oof. Just 19. drops. to stun into the reds looking to play this with a lot of power that's a good split he's got a real go. here so these reds absolutely perfect now 20 to try and help us go one frame away from a very special seventh world title for Ronnie O'Sullivan and well, the match hasn't been as close as anyone really thought, but um, you know, all we can do is, is play what we've been given, and Mark Selby has played absolutely atrocious stuff in this match. You know, and we've 30. knocked in four tons to break the, the centuries record. It would be nice to try and... Uh, Get six in the final. Thirty-four. I'm sure that'll happen. But we'll see. Forty-one. Oh, can't quite get to that one. Bit of a shame. First massively loose positional Six. shot. So. Not an easy one, but a half chance. But the pink's there. Well played. That was made more difficult due to the rest being used. 48. And does the black pass this red? It probably will, so. Looking to play this softly. Forty-nine. So black. And we're getting there. Perfect position. Fifty seven. I'll bounce off the cushion would be nice and before uh, goes. Good chance to get rid of this red. Is 65. Been good stuff so far in this frame. Just the black needed now. And there goes the black, so we are going to be one frame away now. Seventy-three. Well, he's looking at potting this into the right corner pocket. Well, there goes the black. That's a beauty. 80. Even players this stopped on uh, the DIY the table to, to watch this. <laughs> 81. So. He's playing for the right corner here. Oh, Christ. That wasn't the that wasn't the best uh, 
87. The best shot in the world, was it? Really want the sentry ability. Well, it goes. Half a chance. There goes the red. Is it going to get there? It is. Oh, not quite, but that break of 87 gives us the frame and we move one frame away from winning Ronnie O'Sullivan's seventh world title and equaling the record set by Stephen Hendry back in 1999. So, Mark Selby breaks off in what he hopes won't be the last frame of this match but it'll be a monumental effort for him to win this title now 14 frames in a row he needs to win and well look at that oh nearly went to plan <laughs> but, uh, well played good safety there Oh, that's on the way down. Just missed the power bar slightly, which you've seen throughout the Virtual World Championship and he throughout the green. my Foul. Uh, league matches. Foul Mark Selby. Four. Things happen. But, uh, you wouldn't expect us to miss it a second time, but we have done. Ooh, we missed the power bar, but still hit the red. This cue ball could be very good. Ooh, not quite. We'll settle for it. Oh, and now it's Mark Selby's turn. Oh, surely it's That's not going to be. Really annoying. It's not going to be three miss through and wins the world championship, is it? Playing this again. Sort of sum this this match up. Oh, no, he's missed it again. Um. No, I, I couldn't possibly, couldn't possibly do do that. I fancy Mark to miss it a third time, so I'm actually going to play on this time. Because I, I just do not want to win this seventh world title with a three miss rule from Mark Selby. So I hope you guys understand that. I know it wouldn't be the realistic shot, but. Equally, Mark Selby wouldn't go for the thin. <laughs> he's going for it this time. And there you go, he's missed it again. So, good job. Uh, he did take it on. Well, he's given away the foul. Foul and a miss. Ronnie O'Sullivan, four. He's elected to play on here. We could have actually made him um, take that again. Had him sweating again. I think I can get this behind the brown. Oh, it's going to hit the green again. Hey, actually hits a red. Yeah, it would have been an awful way to be win this. But, uh, cross double safety. You need good control over the pace of the white with this shot. Right into the black. Perfect. Couldn't hit that better. Okay, the white's got a little awry, but... Uh, the cue ball looks pretty safe here. And is this going to end up behind the yellow? Oh, just too hard.
now and then where's this cue ball going to end up he's brought reds into play but look where this cue ball is what a shot from Mark Selby where's that been this match it's granite safety play pace is very important here and he doesn't want to under hit this so coming off two cushions trying to rest into the, the back of this cluster this looks good that is perfect that's a great escape there oh it's touching, touching ball. ball that's surely going to be a foul maybe not maybe it was touching a different ball uh, but we're, we're sort of stuck in the middle of this bunch now it's weird <laughs> this could be uh, quite the, the tippy tap battle um, yeah, you can hear the, the DIY has started up again now, so, um, they're not, they're not expecting it to finish anytime soon. This is an intriguing safety battle. Yeah, he's going to try and get back, oh, where's the cue ball going? Oh, it's alright. It looked like it was going towards the pocket on, uh, from that camera angle. Now then, there's a possible cut into the corner it's not easy actually okay. glance off these reds and get this behind the brown this could be a match winner Oof. just a little hard but still tough for Mark to get safe. And he's playing a containing safety. Where's the black going? Great shot. That's in the corner nice. pocket. That sort of helps slightly with the, the safety play here. But again, good length on the cue ball. Plays a bit more of an uh, expressive safety shot, and look at this. It's a great length. Good shot. That's an excellent shot. So. Just got to hit this a bit thicker. Yeah. Played it well. Not worried too much about the pace of the cue ball. This could be a bit of a classic frame, this, coming up. This looks good. This looks very good. That looks very safe to me. Great shot. A bit unlucky that he's not got the snooker on all, all the right-hand side of the table. Certainly probably expected it. Well, there's the safety mistake from Mark Selby. Could that be his last That's shot of shot. this year's World Championship? Could this be the chance to win Ronnie O'Sullivan's seventh One. world title and our second in a row in this career mode? And we successfully defend it. Oh, is it going to... Oh, it's... It's not gone far enough, so let's end the break, I think, unless we fancy this into the left middle. But you know me, chance to win the match. Always going to go for me shots. It's not there. No, not quite. Pretty so close, though. We'll have to wait that for another chance. And Mark Selby actually oh, has a bit of a chance here. This red along the cushion does go. One. Unless he takes the black here. Well, he is doing. I was, didn't fancy him to take the black. Uh, but I suppose it. Yeah, it's Tremendous not shot. an easy table, this. Nine. 
Not an easy table yeah, at all. Well. Fourteen. Fifteen. So blue. Nicely onto a red. Did that well. Twenty. I mean, he's gonna have to bring some reds into play at some point. Twenty one. Could do that here off the pink. It's sort of low risk. And he's brought one red into play. I think the bottom red goes. Might be worth taking that fairly soon. Twenty eight. This is probably five more reds he can pot. Thirty three. Thirty-four. He's still got that red up in bulk in case he gets the wrong side of the blue. Thirty-nine. Did that perfectly, so he's on the red at the bottom. He's coming to black. Forty. And that brings the other red into play. He's playing the pink into the corner, and what a shot he's pulled out there. That's great tubal control. Excellent position. Forty-six. Smashes the red in, the red in, so Position that puts him thirty-two oh, points in front, thirty-seven <laughs> now, seventy-five on the table. Three of these reds with high-valued colours well would be enough, and that's exactly what he's got. Well here. Fifty-three, fifty-eight, fifty-nine. Oh, it's just not perfect. Oh, is this going to go behind the blue? 66. No, it's not. So, just 51 in front, just the red needed. Drops. It's there. So, Mark and Selby shuts out his opponent is going to get a frame back here. 67. 69. That red goes to the right middle. So, are we going to see turn up from Selby here? 70. Obviously, you wouldn't say he's got a chance of winning the match at this point, but it'd be nice to see him go down fighting. And still three more frames to play after this one. Very nicely done. In today's video, and hopefully <laughs> we'll win one of them. Nice to see Mark putting together a decent break. Ninety-two. Just the colours left now. Big yellow. It's there. Standing pot. It's right out of the top drawer. Now can he cut this green in? Ninety-four. Yes, he can. Great shot. Ninety-seven. So this brown for the sentry. Oh, he's playing safe. Are you kidding me? Oh, my word, yeah, Selby! The frame, the <laughs> well, I break a 97, gives him the frame. frame That's now 17 5. Well, here we go then. Break off in the 23rd frame. That's this best of 35 encounter. That's not bad. So, there's a red coming out there. I'm going to check if this red goes. And it does. So, so chance now to knock this in. Try and bring some reds into play. That's the plan. Reds in. Look at the reds. Split They've there. split beautifully, and we've got the black to the right middle. One. Could this be? Tricky shot here. 
a good chance. Fabulous. Probably not get a better one for a while. Excellent position. Don't fancy there. us to clear up here, but uh, we can certainly do some damage. Obviously, the Nine. blokes next door haven't got the memo yet. <laughs> right, black into the corner. It's not bad. Sixteen. Seventeen. Uh, black is potable, but uh, let's just not get ourselves too carried away here. We know Thomas what a blue isn't easy. He is, so I'd assume he'd take this on. But it's there. Uh, That's a wonderful, wonderful pot. Twenty-two. Nicely onto the black. 23. Lots of power on this shot. Now with a load of right hand side, and that's gone pretty well. 30. That's okay. 31. Black's in. I wonder if the red under the pink goes. Have a little look at it. It certainly goes, but I don't think we can get to it from here. So. Oh, are we on the black? Not this time. 39. So, another tester. Of a blue. Well, no surprises here with the long pot attempt. So there goes the blue. Oh, that's a top shot. 44. Not really what he was intending. He lost position. Just over hit that slightly. 52. So, I'm going to be the, the silly cut on this or wait for a better chance. I'm going to have to be wait for a better chance, unfortunately. It's a shame, but. Uh, Not an easy save. Just over hit that. So. Just play the safety. We've got a nice, handy 52-point lead, and we've played a very, very good safety. Lovely length on the cue ball. And now Mark Selby has got to get this safe. Well, it's not bad, but I think this red goes, and it does. So he's taking the red on. Shot to nothing. So close, but Not he's missed quite. it. That'll annoy him. The only red I could leave was the one I was playing. And look what red we've left. Unless the brown's covered some of the pot and angle. It hasn't. So Mark Selby has himself his last chance saloon of this match. Six. He's got to make a frame win and break from this. Seven. If he doesn't... It's match over. 14. And that might already be end of break. No, he's playing this one into the middle. Bit surprised at that. Brilliant pot. Outstanding. But played it well. 15. He's played a cannon. 22. How's it gone? It's gone bad. What's he played here? Surely that bottom red goes into the right middle. 22. Can I have a close look? That's very, very tight. Just cannot 
tell if that if that goes. If it goes, it's the match winner. Look from this side. I think it might do, you know. Definitely try and aim it towards the near jaw. Not an easy one, but a half chance. Yep, yeah, it's there. It's there. Nice. So the red's in. He's right on top of his game at the moment. One. Now then. That was, uh, well, he's looking at potting this into the right corner pocket. A nervy one. Not as nervy as that, though. I'm pretty sure that's not the position he was intending. Well, Eight. Aren't you a genius, Neil? This won't be easy. I've got a possible cut, what and that looks good. Top. Well, we couldn't have played that any better. Superb positional shot. So scores on the doors. We're now 49 points in front with 51 on the table. This green for our seventh world title. Not quite. 39 in front. That was bad well. maths. <laughs> so 42 points in front now. 51 on the table. This red... And any colour this red for the title. Red's not there. Played it in a way that we weren't really going to leave it on. And I don't think Marco. Oh, he is playing it. That's a top shot. So the problem was that he's now going to have to play the yellow, which restricts what colours he can play after this. So it's got to be a good positional shot. And it couldn't have been any better. So, thirty-nine behind. To pop this into the right corner. Forty-three on the table. In it goes. He needs at least. Four. Well, he's playing the blue. So this is going to take him thirty-three. Nine. So he needs at least the pink after this, and looks straightforward enough. To get another frame on the scoreboard here. Down it goes. So there goes the red. And this is looking good now. Well, I wasn't expecting this. I've got to. I've got to admit. Seventeen. I didn't think he would clear the table, the but is he on the yellow? He is. Only just though. Nineteen. Only just. So, the four remaining 22. colours now to win this frame by two points and keep his glim, his slim, slim uh, chances of winning this title. 31. Now, can he All drop right. this into the right corner? Oof, I thought he might have missed that pink. Well, it's a great clearance from Mark Selby of 44. And he wins another frame, but still needs another 12. It's 17 6 now. Thank you, frame 23. But yeah. Bad maths there uh, was what did us, unfortunately. But, get ourselves another chance. Just got to pick ourselves up and get on with it. Red's in. It's okay. One. So, up to top and right hand side here, try and get into the reds. Plenty of power. No. I'm not sure what happened there, but that's a poor shot. Not quite. Eight. Don't think this red goes either, so can't play it as a shot to nothing, so just a safety. So, yeah, it's uh, always good when you get so close and then all of a sudden there's 15 reds back on the table. But hey ho, we've done it 17 times before. 
in this final. You just need to do it one more time. That's a poor shot, really. He's aiming for the left corner here. It's a good pot, but one. Assume you're not going to take this black on. I don't know. I think we got to. This is a half try chance. and make something happen here. That's a great black scene. Lucky if he's not anything here. And I think we're on this red on the bottom cushion. Eight. So another chance to win Tricky the match here. Along the cushion here. Already had a couple. Nine. So it was the hardest one to win. Sixteen. I don't think we'll get a much better chance to get onto this red. Drop this in gently. And that opens up the other three. So, it's a good time to go for that one. Really well played. Whew, I think we're okay. We're on this red. That could have went wrong though. Twenty-five. Thirty. The blue in now. Just wants this pot to drop into the pocket. Thirty-one. Rolling them in Williams style here. 37. It's working out pretty well so far. In. 45. I don't see us messing up from here, but I thought that last frame. And all of a sudden, we played a poor positional shot and. 46. Chance over. But we seem to be playing these nice and controlled. 53. A delicate mm. touch required here. Is that going to reach? Is that going to reach? Needs to reach. 54. Oh. Whew. <laughs> Heart in the mouth moment there. Black's in. Don't want to slip Very past well the red. Mm. 61. It'd be okay. So, just the red required here. And there's the red, and that's our seventh world title, everybody. And that should be it. it that's that quickly crept up on us, didn't it? 62. But uh, what a performance it's been in this final. And okay, Mark Selby hasn't, you know, performed anywhere near his best, but. When he has had chances, he's generally this to drop gently into the pocket. done a decent job with them. I think just overall our safety play, yeah. our break building. We've had four tons so far. We've just been by far the better player. And we're going to win this with a session to spare, which is crazy. I really didn't expect that. Um, obviously, the final hasn't been won with a, a session to spare for... A very, very long time. So that's ended up more awkward than he would have it's, wanted. Uh, Seventy-eight. That's an honour, really. We've been able to to do it and win Ronnie O'Sullivan's seventh world title. Eighty-five. Defend our title as well from season two.
delicate touch required here. And in much less dramatic fashion than 86. the semi-final, at least. Which went down to a deciding frame. Can we finish it off with a ton? It's not the best positional shot. 92. Really isn't, is it? Right. This is really tricky. Come on, you beauty. No, it looks a bit thin. Oh no, it's in! It's in! 93. So this black for the century and our 18th of the tournament. It's there, so turn up for one final time in this World Championship. Oh. This looks relatively easy. And I think, you know, our performance today proves more than anything that... 101. You know, it's it's our form that is mainly the reason behind uh, what have been some odd results, really, in this World Championship. Beating Judd Trump by 13 frames to 3. Uh, beat Mark Williams 13-7, which was a lot more comfortable than we expected. Tremendous form. Um, you know, and our form wasn't at its best against Neil Robertson, who put up the best fight so far against us, but uh, we did eventually come out on top there He's as well, finding our him. form towards the end of that match. And in it goes. And it's just been an absolute pleasure to cover season three of this career mode, closing in on nearly 300 episodes now. It's been absolutely crazy. And uh, I'm so glad that you guys are still tuning in every day at the moment to watch Snooker 19 videos. It's absolutely crazy. I really do appreciate it. And, uh, well, season four will be starting in a few days' time. We'll allow people to catch up a little bit with what's happened in season three and winning our seventh world title we'll have the experiment video out tomorrow 120 and a history of the save so far video coming out as well in the next few days so can't wait to to talk you through what's happened in this save so far it's been very interesting but here we go can we clear up with a 135 at the end of this match there it goes, the Blacks in, and with that break of 135, we win the World Championship, beating Mark Selby by 18 frames to 6. That's it, that's the win, what a final, what a match. there you have it then lifting Ronnie O'Sullivan's uh, seventh world title with a top break of the match there at the end as well 135 our fifth century break of the match and just a really comfortable performance in the end I cannot believe we managed to do that but 18 frames to six we beat Mark Selby oh, and win our second world title in a row and uh, it really was so fun to play through that final and there you go 2022 champion Ronnie O'Sullivan so there you have it £10,000 high break award as well for the 147 40 grand for the 147 pretty uh, happy with our, our day's work there but you can see uh, we've now got the, the, the Kaspersky Riga Masters coming up. It's always a big come down. But we have moved up to two in the world. We've moved above Mark Williams. 1.7 million we're on now. So 500,000 more to get ahead of the Jester from Leicester. But this is the final standings from this season. The top 16. You can see there Dave Gilbert uh, hanging on to 16th position there. Um... But Barry Hawkins and Kyron Wilson well established in the top eight as well as ourselves uh, up there in second. So fantastic to see our 11th uh, ranking tournament of the series so far. Looking to uh, fill up this trophy cabinet as much as possible. 
Uh, we we only got two stars for it because of of course we didn't do it all on master plus uh, on master difficulty. Sorry, I assume that's what the the star rankings uh, mean. But uh, yeah, still want to get that UK championship in the bag as well. Uh, but we'll have a little look at uh, the season summary. So season three of this career mode, four ranking tournament victories. No uh, invitational tournament victories this season, unfortunately. Uh, finishing rank two, highest rank of the season as well. We've got six high break awards, highest break of a 147, which was in the first round of the World Championship. Season prize money, uh, uh, sorry, £1,169,750 and career prize money so far, so far nearly £2 million. So, there you have it then, the end of Season 3, and we will be uh, continuing into Season uh, 4 of this career mode on Master Difficulty. Uh, we've got the Kaspersky Riga Masters coming up for you guys. Uh, obviously, I don't have to qualify for that event so as the world champion, so um, you can see all of that. It says skipped event, but uh, we will be playing in it. Um, I assume, yep, yeah, I assume it um, just uh, put us uh, uh, put us out of the tournament. But uh, yeah, I'll, I'll be back with probably the last 32 or the, the last 16. In a few days' time, I'm going to have a couple of days off from Snooker 19 and, and show you guys uh, some of the, the, the league matches I've been playing in. And uh, I'll probably do a stream of the uh, online tournament at some point as well, just just to, to fill the gap for the next few days and, and maybe on Saturday uh, we'll start again with Season 4. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, make sure you leave a like down below. It means the absolute world to me. Uh, it really does help out the channel and the Two Phase Project as well. Uh, there's three links down below if you really want to support the channel uh, further in its development. Subscribe for daily Sunday 19 videos and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.